to my course for introduction to programming using Solidity for us to program smart contracts. My name is Alex Louis. I'll be your host. This short course, I'm going to show you how to write smart contracts, deploy them using the Ethereum network, the test network, and we'll go into a lot of that good stuff. Enough with that. I'm going to now do some fun things with you. First, you need to install a development environment. And for us to do that, we're going to install first Node.js, then Truffle, and then test our PC. All these will be used for you to create your smart contracts. It's not as hard as it sounds because initially these, this course will be using Remix, which is the online compiler. But let's get this installed first so that you already have it set up. The first thing you need to do is go to nodejs.org forward slash en forward slash download and pick your installer. I have a 64-bit machine, 64-bit OS, so I am going to install the 64-bit version of Node.js. So I'm going to click on 64-bit. It's going to download and you should double click on it and you're gonna get this screen pop up. Click on run. Once you click on run, you're gonna get this screen pop up. Just gonna have to follow the motions. You click on next, scroll down, yes, all the terms and agreements, click next. Pick a installation directory that you want this on. I just leave it at the default, click next then you're gonna have a couple of these things a custom setup if you want to customize some things I just leave it as is for now click next then click on install and this is going to take a while so I am going to pause the video and we'll come back when this is finished installing okay so we're back completed good click on finish and you're done with node.js the next thing I want you to do is I want you to open up a DOS window. If you don't know how to do that, then you're in trouble. Let me just tell you how to do it. Click on start on the lower left hand corner of your Windows machine. Then there should be an option that says run or search programs and files. Type in CMD. CMD should bring up a black box like this. Once you're in this black box, you should type in NPM. And if you did it right, you should see a couple of options here. Now, we want to install Truffle, which is going to be our Ethereum development environment. So let's go to the Truffle NPM site. Once you're here, you see the command to install Truffle is it's easy it's as easy as that what you're gonna do is you're going to type in npm install g truffle then press enter you're gonna see this install and you're done now you have Truffle running I'll show you how to initialize Truffle uh, in the upcoming videos. For now, we just want to continue and focus on just installing the things that we need to build a smart contract. Okay, next thing we need is a simulated blockchain, which is going to be TestRPC. So if we go to the NPM TestRPC site, it's going to show you how to install TestRPC. Same deal. You're going to type in npm install whatever it says on this page. So let me do that. Ethereum JS test RPC. So once we do that, press enter and it's going to install. Okay. Did it install here? Let me see. Oops. What am, what am I missing? It should say install, right? So it should say npm install, and then, so let me do that. Got distracted. So let's do that. And now that's, that's what I like to see. 
that's what I like to see so it will install test RPC which is your simulated ethereum blockchain that you're gonna use it's better than downloading the whole blockchain to your machine so once you've installed the test RPC and truffle we perhaps want to test <clears throat> their functionality make sure you, you install it correctly so test RPC to test it is easy all you have to do is type in test RPC and you should see something like this and then you see listening on localhost 8545 so you have the EVM uh, server running on your machine now these are the accounts that you have available just emulated accounts on your local machine called test RPC and these are the private keys for each account if you installed it correctly and everything went as as is then you should be able to see this when you type in test RPC if you want to see if truffle was successfully installed all you have to do is let's say let's make a directory here called ethereum test We'll go into that directory and then I'll create another directory called project one we'll go into project one okay so right now it's empty so if I want to create a default project that will be created by truffle with all the files that I need for me to deploy it then I would type in truffle init and it'll download it and then you'll see that it unbox it unbox means it's downloading the test project so now if I do a D dir then I'll have contracts folder migrations folder and a test folder with my JScript JavaScript files intact and now I'd be ready to write a simple contract compile it migrate it and then test it now I'm not gonna do that in this video because then it's gonna make it longer than it seems so all we've done now is install an environment couple of issues that you're gonna run into and I'll go over them in the next few videos when you try and compile your truffle project and migrate uh, but an easy fix it's easy fix that's what I'm here for so I research the errors and then if you come across them then I'll solve them for you if you've enjoyed this video please click on like as this is a free course and I am not putting any ads on the course so if you take the full long course you will not see any ads thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next video take care